This is the fish. This is the one I came for. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh jeez. This is a big fish. Oh. Hey hey, welcome back to the channel. It's Jesse. This is BC Fishing Journal, and we are back on the kayak. This is day three on the ocean, and uh, obviously not back to back. But uh, this is my third time out on the ocean, and so. This is my new favorite thing, and I am so excited that you're a part of this. We're gonna, I'm just gonna go out. I've never been to this section of water before. Um, usually I do some homework and some scoping out, usually the bottom. And so I think I, I have a game plan, and I've looked at the, the tides, I know where I'm gonna go. And so that's always important with kayaking, I've learned, is that you gotta have a game plan. So I have a game plan because I'm by myself. Anyway, uh, thanks for being here and being a part of this journey, and uh, let's get to it. All right, look at this morning. Could you ask for better? I don't think so. All right, what a day. Woohoo! Look at that sunrise. Look at what the Lord has created. Might be a school rockfish actually. Oh, there could be a school rockfish around 25, 30 feet. Let's just try. Let's see what we get here. All right, we're on. First drop, and I think it's a little uh, rockfish, a decent rockfish. We're oh yeah. Ooh, it's a nice one. Look at this guy. Look at the look at the spots on him. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, that's a nice fish. We're not too deep, so I can kind of. He's not bulged out or anything. Okay, we're dropping. There is a lot of bait down there. A lot. Oh, there he goes. Oh, he got something small. Oh, something small bit. Oh, he's a little heavier though. He's pulling me like this. What is this? Could be a green lean? Could be a leaf head. I don't know what it is. A little rockfish. Oh, it is a green leaf. Ah, yes, the trusty Lucifino green leaf. Ah, oh, yes. I had a feeling it was a green leaf, actually. This one's got a little more weight to it. I might bonk this guy. Ah, we can get three of these, so. A female green leaf. Oh, it looks like a lingcod took a chunker out of her tail there. But they're beautiful, gorgeous fish, really good eating. The males have those really distinct blue patchy spots. Got a little soft cooler in the back here. Got my water and my bait in there if I need any. Not that I don't think I do. Oh, I'm on right away. As soon as I drop it. Okay, we're on. I saw a fish go right after it. On oh, my marker, actually. Is that a marker? Oh, get out of here. what is this? This is heavier. This could be a good ling. It's not fighting like a ling, though. It's fighting like a rockfish. It's a heavy rockfish. I'll keep it. Yeah. It's a decent rockfish. That's what I thought. Decent. We're in 70 feet of water, so I can... That guy's not bad, eh? You wanna keep this guy? Oh, barely hooked. Just barely. There he goes. See, it's nice when they see him splash like that. He's, he'll make it, no problem. It's... Oh, there he is. There he is, there he is. Oh, this is a good one. This is good. This is a better fish. This is a good fish, boys. This is a lingcod. This is a lingcod. Here we go. Could be keeper. Oh, maybe slip giving up. Uh. Uh. What do we got? Yeah, it's a ling. Let's see how big. Oh, not great. Not huge. Nope, not big enough, I don't think. It's a good ling cod, eh? Not bad, but not a keeper. 
he fought good at first when he first hit i thought oh boy i thought that was a good sized fish but no for not let's well we're in the right area though i need a 26 inch chilling or greater rockfish it looks like he's got some it looks like he's got some weight it's always oh another green lean wow all right two green leans, two females all right this is a heavier one. i'm keeping this one this is a good size one this one i'm keeping for sure uh, oh we got another kelp green lean that was a bigger female and uh, that uh, makes two cup green lean out, so that's great. So I think you can keep three, but I don't know if I'm going to keep any more than that. Two is probably good, but I'm going to probably keep one rockfish as I can, as my license allows, and hopefully a big lingcod. That's what I'm really targeting, a big one. We've got uh, one that was about 20 inches, but uh, negative on the legal side. I could put a big bait on. And we'll draw the bigger fish. But this lure is so fun. Man, it's just been it's just a hoot. And I mean, that's what we're here for. Here. Oh, there we go. There we go. It's never long. This guy fights his head shaking really well. But he's not heavy. He's not heavier like the last guy. Man, this guy's fighting good. The scrappy uh, rockfish. Nope. Scrappy. Okay, so this is a good example. This is another kelp green. So this is a male. So you can just see the very distinct blue markings. That that indicates a male kelp green. The other ones where it's like the kind of the smaller spotting pattern and lots of them. That's a female. clip popped off we got ourselves a link eye trolling through the rocks here I don't know how big it is I'm gonna see here it might be close actually it feels much it's amazing how much smaller they feel on the no just a baby just a baby but it's kind of cool to get one on the on the troll that's for sure that's cool there we go there we go Oh, I'm on some heavy. Oh yeah, this is good. This is a good fish. This is a good fish. This is a good fish. This might be the fish here, boys. This is the fish. This is the one I came for. Yeah. This is the only time. Yeah. Oh, this is heavy. This might be the fish here, boys. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, this is gonna have sideways or something. Oh yeah. Oh, jeez. This is a big fish. Okie okay, dinah. Okay, maybe this could be a salmon. It feels like a lingcod because it's just swinging. Spidey is going. Oh, this is big. This is the fish, boys. Come on. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh. Let's see what we got. Oh, yeah. This is the lingcod here. This is the one. Oh, this is the keeper. Yeah. This is the keeper linger. 
Oh, how do I want to keep this guy? Oh boy, he's barely hooked. Oh boy. I want to keep this guy, so let's just do this. Let's just let him for safety. I don't care if I get the hook wrapped up in there right now. Whew. This is a keeper linger for sure. Yeah. I know it's not ideal. You don't want to get your hooks and all this stuff wrapped up here. I don't like that, but this guy is our fish that we've been looking for. He's our blue wing. Ugh. heavy too. I just do a double check on the weight and all the size. Just in case. Better to be safe than sorry, hey? I want to get the ramp there and say, oh, he's only 25. But yeah, he looks more... Yeah, I'll get a little fight. In the boat. In the boat. In the boat. Oh yeah, he's there. He's easy. Oh yeah, he's he's almost he's 29, almost 30 inches. This guy's going in the bucket. This is a big one. That was a good fight. Good little tilt. Nighty night. He gone. It's a blue one too. Did you ask for more? Look, he's got something in his mouth. What has he got? Oh, he's got another sharp fish in his mouth. Woo! Oh, it's like a green lean or something. He's mowing. Chomping. Look at that, boys. That is what we came for. That's the perfect size eater. Perfect size eater. Another one. Some, some, I don't know what that was actually. The perfect size. Look at that. <laughs> oh yeah. I might, might have to take a photo of this guy. So I was I was worried about like that lure saying it wasn't catching the big fish, but look at that. The buzz bomb proved me wrong again. We've got everything. All the species that we want to hit. We've well, that's the trip. Go for a couple hours, and then we uh, head back home. The nice thing about the kayak is you just clean it out. You can do the, you can do the trip so fast, which is really conducive. It's really conducive to my lifestyle right now, where I have two kids and a family. That's the most important, obviously. So if I can get out once a week, perfect. And it's only for a couple hours, so I usually like to get up at first light. So I get a good start but uh, and then I'm done by you know 8 o'clock 8 30 made it perfect I get back home and the family's just getting up and getting ready to get their day started all right we're heading back thank you so much for watching this is DC fishing journal and uh, many more kayak adventures coming your way